Photo Hack, episode number two. Hi, I'm Joel Grimes with the Joel Grimes Academy, and we're gonna talk about a photo hack that I use, and I've been using probably for about 30 years. And that is how to save money shipping your gear through the airlines. So, uh, on a typical year, I'm probably on the plane a hundred times and so I'm shipping gear most of the time and so when it comes to my light stands my big modifiers I can ship a case like this this is the Westcott um, I'm not sure what this is called it's through Westcott one of their big uh, shipping cases and this if I go on the airlines it's a 50-50 um, sometimes I can get it on without having to pay extra baggage but most of the time I'm gonna pay extra premium to ship this through the airlines. I drop it off at the front, uh, front counter and they're gonna go ching ching and it'll probably cost me 100 bucks, so that's 200 bucks round trip. So uh, that adds up. If I can bill it to the client, great. If I'm kind of doing a, a, a like I'm gonna go do a workshop or somewhere where I'm speaking and they're paying me only pennies, peanuts, I gotta save them every little bit I can. So um, this is not a good solution. Now I also have it's in, it's in my storage over there, a light um, wear case that's a little bit bigger. I call it my coffin. And that is an amazing case. I've had it for about 20 plus years. It looks like it. It's still holding up. But every time I take that to the airlines, I'm getting charged 100 if not sometimes $200 to put that on the airlines. The airlines have gotten harder and harder, or the restrictions are getting greater and greater every time I go. They're always changing it. So now it's, it used to be 70 pounds, now it's 50 pounds. You can't get over 50 pounds without paying a premium. So what is the solution I've been doing for years and years? In fact, uh, almost every time I go on a photo trip, someone makes a comment and I'm gonna show you why. Here, here's my photo hack. It's a golf, a, a soft shell golf club case I bought on Amazon for about $69. That case that I just had, I think is $200. The lightware case that I have is $900 plus dollars. This is 70 bucks, 69 bucks on Amazon. Um, the brand is Caddy Daddy. Of course, I wouldn't get nothing but the best. I put all my light stands, my modifiers, um, I pack this up, I have a little weight thing, I make sure it's under 50 pounds. I slap this on the, uh, the little uh, weighing you know, station there at the front desk, they don't even blink an eye. And everyone thinks I'm going on a vacation golfing. But I pack everything in here, then I have my, if I need, I'll have my uh, Pelican cases, I put my strobes in and stuff like that. But for my long gear, my long modifiers, I can get, even get my paint pole in here, my paint pole adapter where I hold you know, my modifier on the end of it, I can put it all in here and they don't blink an eye. If they ask you what's inside, uh, or they'll say uh, golf clubs, I say golf club case. I don't lie, but once, maybe twice in all these years, they open it up and they said, hmm, where's the golf clubs? And they don't like that because they're giving the golfers a break. Um, and I, you know, this is not super big, but it has to go sometimes through special oversized, whatever. So I don't lie, but I just say golf club case. And then of course, when I'm toting it around, people are always asking me if I'm on vacation, I'm going to go uh, golfing somewhere. And especially when I'm pulling into North Dakota in the middle of winter with a golf club case, I usually raise a few eyebrows. This is a great solution to get your gear on to the airplane without paying a premium. And I've used hard shell golf club cases too. They actually work pretty good. And I have, I've had, I don't know, three or four different ones of those. I've gone to the soft sh shell because it's actually a little easier for me to tote around. So I usually put my uh, Pelicans and whatever, on, there's one of them's on wheels, I piggyback it, get my, my camera case on there, and then I can roll this and roll everything through the airport. Or I'll put it on a cart, I'll just pay that five bucks and put everything on a cart and get it over to my rental car. But it's easier for me to move this thing around. Plus, in the back of a small uh, rental car, this has a little bit of give, I can stick it in there, uh, back in a seat of a, you know, whatever. This makes a little more sense. So, 
$70 investment. This has some padding in it. So don't put anything here that can get majorly crushed. I've never had anything break in here. But just be careful. You don't throw your strobes in here or anything that's of, of, that might be breakable. There you have a hack that I've been doing and using for over 30 years to save money, which puts more money into my wife's pocket. So don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe and hit that little bell. And then you can keep up with all my current content.